Hello friends. Okay, so for our first video, um... Or technically second, because we made a video of making the... This is our second video. Dicks. <laughs> Hi class. Hi friends. Okay, so for our second or third YouTube upload, whatever this is going to end up being, um, we are going to watch and listen to um, this man on YouTube who made his own ugly stick. And he's from Newfoundland, and he's like a real, he's a real gem, and we're gonna watch him. He has a few videos on his channel that is like lesson one, lesson two, lesson three on like ugly stick. Um, he's kind of kidding, kind of serious, so it's kind of funny. Um, we're gonna listen to it and then try to do some of the stuff that he's doing at the same time, because we've watched the video a few times over, but just for like your purpose of watching this adventure. We will play along to it. So you can kind of like listen to what he has to say and watch us. Oh, I don't think I've seen these watch things Watch us derp. Oh, yeah. We did these off camera as well. I don't yeah, know so videos. basically, Keisha will zoom in and show you. So, okay, so this was like a wooden spoon in the dollar store. And my dad like sawed ridges into it so we can get like a okay. more like, like a different effect. Because then do this. As opposed to just this. So we can have those. Make more noise. More percussive. Yes. That's the thing with the ugly stick, is the more percussive you can make it, the better the stick. So like, if we were going to put doll heads on the top, but then we were like, thinking that the can makes some better noise. So yeah. we did cans instead. And then like, putting grooves on the spoon to hit it with also makes more noise and like, yeah. So that's kind of the point of ugly sticks, trying to make it as percussive as possible. But anyways. Also, I you. am like, kind of disabled. And, because I kind of sprained my wrist, but anyway. We'll manage. We'll, we'll figure it out. So, I'm going to play this dude's video. Well, hello again. By the by the way, what a response I got from people in YouTube, from people in Facebook, new planners all over the world in Facebook, uh, to my YouTube performance well, of, uh, of playing the ugly stick. And hello there to the people in the kitchen, too. This is simply lesson two. Uh, I Next heard all sorts of wonderful yeah. comments. People enjoyed the music, both screen the music. They enjoyed the, the, the vision, the visual of uh, playing the um, <clears throat> the Newfoundland ugly stick. But I heard from my critics too, yes. and my critics said uh, that wasn't uh, a lesson. That was more of a performance. I said, true sure enough. One fellow said, over. "What is that silly hat you wear on your head?" We Boy, in that's in a head. traditional Newfoundland South Africa hat. We're proud of it. Uh, one lady said, um, "She said uh, you're handsome, but uh, why do you wear those baggy pants?" So today, I'm wearing my Sunday best. My good blue Sunday best pants. Uh, what else? I heard from all sorts of people, and uh, somebody said, why don't you really give us a lesson show us actually how to play it? So, all right, first things first. Oops. The boot. Just hit the ceiling there. The boot. The boot. Uh, you gotta have the boot at the bottom. All right, a couple of screws there. Put it in. Use in nails. the stick itself, you can have bottle caps. And you screw them in with screws. If you use nails, after pounding it for a while, uh, the nails are going to fall out, as one youngster found out. Except we use nails, and they didn't fall out, because I'm uh, awesome. You have a can over here. Yeah. Don't have that Tim Hortons, but go ahead for them. Uh, top of the uh, can up here, paint can. A lot of people have an ugly stick, and they put a can on the top. I put a doll's head, and the kids get a good kick out of it, and I go, I'm not advocating violence or anything now, just a little fun. And, uh, the idea of playing the uh, ugly stick is to do two to one, two to one, as I said in the previous video. So I'll show it to you over here. The idea is to go keep the beat going, and then keep the bowl here two to one. If I show it sideways, if I do it really slow, the camera will pick it up. Okay. 
now. Okay, so that was us listening and watching the man with the ugly stick and deciphering how to go about playing it. And it's really not that difficult. So in our next episode, pretty straightforward. I guess you'll see us playing along to a Newfoundland trad probably, song. Probably, probably a reel of some sort. A reel, but. yeah. We'll have a few uploads of us playing and learning things. Learning things. So stay tuned, boys and girls. Progressively better at it. Yeah, two two one, two two one, one two two one, two 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 one. Ding 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 ding. Okay, bye. Okay, end the video because that's fucking great. We're keeping that. <laughs> it can even go in the end. It's recording, yeah. I volleyballed too hard, just in case anyone actually sees this.